A new teacher pension bill is moving forward in Frankfurt. In the past, teachers fought back against changes to their pension system by coming to the Capitol and making their voices heard. But now the Capitol is closed to visitors. Political reporter Carolina Butrek speaking with educators who are watching the action from a distance. In the past, it was easy to tell if a pension bill was being discussed here at the Capitol because you would find teachers everywhere in these hallways. They would fill up these stairs wearing red, holding signs, making their voices heard. But this year, they're not here because the Capitol is closed to visitors. Save our schools! Save our schools! This is what we've come to expect when teachers' pensions are up for reform. Teachers have spent the last few years closely monitoring different pension bills, even fighting back against proposed changes. We are Kentucky, 120 strong. But today, the Capitol was quiet as a new pension bill moved forward. This is House Bill 258. The bill doesn't impact any retired or current teachers, but any teacher hired after January 1st of 2022 they would be a part of a hybrid pension benefits plan. It is a 100% funded new tier. It does not close out the old legacy plan. It is a new tier. The bill's sponsor said the bill was completed with full transparency, with teachers groups having a seat at the table. And today, several groups spoke out in favor of the change. Houston Barber, uh, representing Kentucky Association of School Superintendents, President-elect. And does your association have a position on this particular piece of legislation? Yes, sir, we are in full support. Groups like the Kentucky Education Association haven't taken a stand on it yet but they have raised some concerns. Should this bill become law, any teacher hired under its provisions will have to work longer and pay more for a lower guaranteed defined benefit upon retirement. And 120 Strong finds that unacceptable. Several of their members rushed to the Capitol today after hearing about a new pension bill. We are retired teachers standing here for future teachers to make sure that they have the benefits they need to have a long, successful career. They worry this will ultimately hurt public education in Kentucky because they think teachers won't want to work here. And the group is frustrated that this is all happening during the pandemic when they can't go inside to voice their concerns. In our view, this is the sewer bill all over again because we can't go in the building. In Frankfurt, Carolina Butchuk, Evening Edition.